Okay, welcome back. I said I would uh, install cargo spaces on this thing, and I have, and I've also fully repaired it. So let's have a look. Uh, 59 inch roller drums, got a windshield, still got the old wheels on. Might as well just leave them. Don't really see any reason to take them off. Uh, cargo spaces next to the driving seat. Still got a V12 engine. Um, there's nothing there. That will be a chemical thing. What's it called? Onboard chemistry lab, I think. And they're going to get for the forge rig and the food co kitchen buddy as well. Got the kitchen and the fridge. <laughs> it's got a muffler on it. Because, you know, going to make that V12 engine quiet. Uh, don't want to get in the back. Some more roller drums. Um, yeah, I'm pretty happy with that. This will be our home. Uh, I also briefly looted this building here. It um, didn't have anything particularly interesting in it. Just some irradiated fruits in the fridge. So that's nice. Um, I don't know if I can turn this around here. Oh boy. Yes. It's been a really long time since I drove... Whoops, that car is going to go through that building. Oh no, it stopped. Yeah, it's been a really long time since I drove a vehicle this large, so... Oh shit, uh, NPC. Um, let's remember which key to press. It does have a gun. Chest of Varna. Not wearing particularly good armor though. Oh. Uh, they're okay. They're friendly enough. Let's ask them what they're doing. Just looking for some wrongs to right. Well, I have a lot of cash cards. I should probably sell some of those. But, um, never mind. Oh, whoa, shit! Right, pay attention to where you're going. Yeah, I gotta remember that my... I wish driving skill would change, kind of. Because, I mean, once it gets to four, you pretty much set, like, you know, you can just drive everywhere and not fumble with the controls, particularly. So, um, you know, it just seems like a toggle, like, you know, now you've hit four, now you can drive, and that's it. So I feel like it should just be a trait or something, you know? Like, it can drive or can't drive, just a binary thing. Ah, it would be nice. Woo! Ah, and yeah, the back end still kicks out. Which is a bit irritating. But, there's a lot of robots around here. Did I kill these last time? Riot control bots and stuff? Yeah, I must have done. It's a shame you can't get their uh, little gas emitting thing, so that you can, like, gas NPCs. Did I just... Did I see a little question mark inside my fire station there? Is there something in there? I really hope not. But yeah, in this um, driver side compartment here, there's uh, a cargo carrier and a frame. Um, and we can use that. We can just take it out anytime we want to make a thing to drag stuff around in. Stuff dragger. There you go. It doesn't matter what I call it. And I can make and disassemble this anytime I want. Uh, and yeah, we got some security camera and robot controls. Apparently, I can't use my welder. Surely, it's close enough. Right, so just just grab it and move a little bit closer. No, huh? I got the welder right there. What's going on? Alright, let's drag it a little bit closer. <laughs> Doesn't make any sense to me. Oh, there you go. Huh, was I more than six tiles away? Two, three... Hmm, I don't know. Anyway. So yeah, now I can use this to grab all of my stuff out of here. And... Yeah, just start loading this thing up. And... I think the plan of action is to visit the two gas stations, and probably a gun store as well, on the way out of town. Uh, I still need to turn in this quest. I'll do that as well, since they seem to be living in that house now. And then, yeah, I'll probably just swing around this hospital and 
go off on a merry adventure. I think, um, let's see, volume 1075, 475. Yeah, so I think I'll do this shit off camera, because it's going to take a while and involve lots of sorting and stuff. I can already tell that space is going to be a premium in this thing. Uh, yeah. Some of these uh, cargo containers are kind of almost full already. Anyway, let's uh, disassemble this. And... The door is already open. Huh? <laughs> Thanks for telling me. That's very useful. Uh, so... Uh, I, the, the problem with this is... Let's just walk over here. Uh, uh, you can't put a no auto pickup zone over a vehicle, so I was just worried I was going to auto pick up stuff. But uh, yeah, I've got medical supplies here, uh, tailoring supplies there. Uh, I don't even remember now. <laughs> Food just behind the driver's seat. The driver's seat has books in it. Whoops. Um, also a few vehicle parts, but. That's alright, we've got the junk and craftable stuff there, and then electronic stuff there. There's nothing in that back one. That'll be the loading bay, I guess. Uh, got tools there on the top, and on the bottom we have weapons and stuff. So, we're ready to go, pretty much. Bye-bye, uh, Firehouse. You have been a nice base. Uh, I did leave something in there, actually. I left three springs, which there wasn't enough room for in my uh, dragonball vehicle, so I'm sure I'll manage without three springs. Uh, let's find this dude. Whoops. Oh, don't repair. Pull a handbrake. My fingers are too fat for my keyboard, quite obviously. Uh, you in here, dude? Oh, there's something in here. I'm hearing wumps. Oh, it's a skeleton. Well, I got my axe out. And, uh... There's a zombie as well. Is the NPC really in here? Or was that, um... Oh, that was another zombie mom, right. Shit. Uh, so I've already done... This is the one that I did last time, I guess. Uh, oh, they're all the way down here. House. No? Is that just another... Was this the first one? I don't even know, man. Yeah, this is the first one I did. This one's pointing at an NPC. Ah, uh, you know, I just can't even bothered with that. Oops. Keep hitting the wrong keys. <laughs> yeah, I just, you know... I get, at the very best, they'll give me some skill points. Uh, no! What? It rammed into a wall, it's not even made contact with it yet. Yeah, I'm gonna crash this car so much. Like, I've already damaged it. Slightly. <laughs> yes, it's it's gonna fall apart. There were a bunch of heavy frames on the, uh, the, the trailer thing that I was um, gutting for the cargo carriers, but uh, I just I couldn't be bothered. <laughs> I didn't want to replace all of the frames on it, you know? It's a lot of work. I might do it eventually. I think once I get some uh, composite armor on it, it'll, um, it'll be a lot more sturdy. Regardless of how uh, sturdy the frames are. Can I get through here? I can. Uh, let's just try and stop. Oh no! That's bad. But okay, this should give us access to a few pumps. Let's go sort this guy out first, though. So otherwise, he's going to be... <laughs> just saying my name over and over again a billion times. Fair enough. Right, let's see. Have these guys got any gas in them? Alright, that's uh, 30%. That's probably enough, honestly. You know, once you fill up a tank, well, the maps aren't that big. Like, they're infinitely generated, obviously, but... Um, you know, it's not like it generates New York City or anything. 
And this town is uh, quite small. It's not a lot of houses in it. Um, all right. Well, I could try. Oh, I'm not standing on the. Yeah, I've got this driving seat in the middle, which is uh oh. Okay, I just lost a piece of frame, I think. Possibly. Can't repair stuff while driving. You can't repair stuff while driving. Alright, oh no. Please don't explode. Alright, okay. <laughs> um, I'm gonna keep repairing this at every available opportunity. Oh, that's irritating. I wish that, uh, like when you butcher, this is a capital B. So you just press the same key again. I wish that was an R. So I could just keep hitting R and have it just to use the top thing, you know? But uh, maybe I'll make that as a suggestion on the forums. Usually works pretty well. Uh, well, something's been down here. Whether it's me or not, I do not know. Right, where's the next one? Right, that was the next one, actually. <laughs> I was supposed to go to that one first. Never mind. Hello, little chibi zombies. Don't mind me. Oh, I see a shocker. That could be fun. I uh, seem to have driven past it, though. It's all good. Um, yeah, so I've got no solar panels on this thing. Because they just get broken. And... The engine with an alternator just charges the batteries just fine, so I'm not really too bothered about solar panels, honestly. Did I just... wow, I just filled the vehicle with that um, gas pump. That doesn't happen very often. Is that guy still there? <laughs> He's just stuck to that wall. Like, I love this wall. I'm going to marry it and call it Charlene. Alright, well, uh, I've already raided these pharmacies, haven't I? Yeah, that's the reason I decided to leave. We'll start at a restaurant, coffee shop. Uh, I'll visit the coffee shop on the way out. See if we can get some coffee, it's quite useful. Um, giant black widows and an NPC I'm having a fight somewhere. I think we'll stay out of it. It's their business, not mine. Alright, uh, let's see if we can get us some coffee. You know, I'm, I'm not going to turn into the parking lot because I'll probably never get out of it again. Alright, let's sort these little buggers out then. Um, did I see a school on the map? I'm pretty sure I did at some point. Yeah, there's one over in the west. So I'll probably visit that at some point for the books. Because they usually have very nice libraries. Lemon and lime soda. Uh, I'm actually good for sodas. I got a whole fucking vehicle full of them. Let's eat some irradiated rhubarbs. That's actually pretty gross, I gotta say. <laughs> uh, well, I can't use the numpad in this menu anymore. Why? Why, developers? Why? Okay. Uh, you know, I'll keep the can. But I will drop these uh, plastic bags. They're pretty useless. I'll probably find out there's some amazing use for them at some point. A hairpin. I'm going to wear a hairpin. Well, nobody's going to stop me. Well, I mean, actually, you don't cut your hair in this game, like, ever. So, you have to imagine that your hair gets pretty goddamn long. I mean, I could tell you, like, I haven't cut my hair in, <laughs> I don't even know, uh, at least five years. And uh, it's pretty fucking long. So, you know, hairpins would be very, very useful. Is there no coffee in here, really? Don't know why I'm checking the toilets. Uh, coffee house with no coffee. Alright. Well, <laughs> it does have bleach, though. It's, uh, it's obviously Starbucks. Seriously though, Starbucks coffee, what the fuck? It's unpleasant. I don't know, maybe I just got the wrong ones or something. Maybe I just don't like coffee. Uh, it's a possibility. Alright, so... 
Gotta get used to where all of the crap is in this vehicle now. I have six lab cards. It's pretty good. I do want to get to the bottom of the lab with this character at some point. It is it's something I've never really done. Um like I've been inside labs, but I tend to leave because it just gets really, really cold and <laughs> you start freezing to death basically. So yeah, I would like to do that at some point. Alright. Now we have to up the speed a little bit so we can get through these uh, shrubs. Which is going to mean careening all over the place, but that's alright. And hopefully we don't damage stuff too much. Let's have a look at it. Yep, it's definitely damaging the frames. As soon as I find something with uh, armor plating on it, I'll uh, kit it out. Shocker Brute, interesting. Why would that be here? Uh, oh, it's all the way down by the shelter. Why? Why does that shelter have zombies around it? Huh. I don't know. I guess somebody chose surrounded stars. <laughs> One of the NPCs. Alright. Uh, I'm just going to stand here while this spitter makes its way over. Because oh, it didn't spit at me. But yeah, the spit goes underneath the vehicle, so you don't need to worry about having your shit dissolved, basically. Um, yeah, the night time is a bit of an issue, isn't it? It's getting dark. I don't particularly fancy going around this uh, hospital in the dark, if I'm honest. Let's take some aspirin. Oh, did they make aspirin more effective? Because that just got rid of my pain in like a second. Uh, some cigarettes and anything here? No. Uh, tomato soup. I was just thinking I could do with some food. Uh, I'm not a fan of tomato soup, honestly. It's a little tart for my taste, but um, I think. It's risky, but I think I might be able to just sleep in this vehicle. Uh, I don't have night vision at all, do I? Nope. Um, okay, I think well, I've got a wearable flashlight. It has no batteries in it. Um, I'm not sure if I have any batteries, honestly. Um, well, that's weird. Uh, is it this one? Yeah, this is where I put my electronic stuff. I guess they're all loaded into these flashlights. <laughs> I don't know. I guess I'll just take the flashlights in with me and just drop them when they run out of charge. Makes sense to me. Uh, whoop. Yeah, this is really going to fuck up my legs, and I know it. But, we need drugs. Stay still. Alright, yeah. Reset the filter. Uh, yeah, there's nothing particularly amazing in here. Somebody left their shirts in here as a vehicle. It's um, phased through the bloody wall somehow. The spit is just not spit anymore, because honestly I'm okay with that. <laughs> Come on. I mean, he's left acid on the floor, but... Ah. I don't know, they do spit. There you go. I'm sad now. I thought they got, like, majorly nerfed or something. But, alas, no. We must put up with their leg dissolving shit. Okay, yeah, like so. Ah, oh, it's such a pain in the backside. Ah, it's the fact that you can't, like, get environmental protection against it. You know, like, you can't, um... You can't, uh, just wear a pair of rubber boots. I'll just hope that it doesn't dissolve your stuff. Oh, Thorazine. Fantastic. Yep, I'll take all of that. Thank you very much. Oh, there's loads of it. 
when I say loads of it, I mean that's not going to last very long. Uh, you pretty much do need to take it every day, I think, if you want the schizophrenia effects to be nullified. Nope, keep continuing to do all of the things. Uh, I'll take this flu shot. It bothers me that it takes no uh, space, and then when you use it, you get a syringe which takes up one space. <laughs> How does that work? Yeah, video games. Uh, these doors look like they're locked, and then they're actually not. Gummy vitamins. Are they really nice? Do we enjoy the gummy vitamins? I don't even know where they are. Oh, there they are. Enjoyed gummy vitamins. Nice. So a little morale boost as well as better um, immune system. It's pretty good. Uh, Alright, so we're coming up to about 20 minutes. I don't think I'm going to spend like three episodes fucking clearing out this hospital, but... Um, yeah, I think I'll just look in a few more rooms, and then next time we'll be driving away. Ooh, this was a good room.